Okay guys, so to start off with you are going to need some scissors, some masking tape, a hammer, some brown paper, some nails or pitch hooks of your choice, whatever you need for your particular frames, and then a pen or pencil, I'm using a couple of different ones. Okay guys, so first of all, you're gonna need to open up your brown paper and make sure you've got your pencil and your picture. And you're just gonna draw around the outline of the picture frame with that pencil just lightly. And then you're just gonna grab your scissors and chop that out. Once you've done that, just make sure you pop that on the back of the frame and grab a pencil or a pen, could be a Sharpie or anything, and mark out where the nail is going to go or the picture hook is going to go. And then you just need to do this for every other picture frame that you're planning to put on the wall. fun part so just grab your brown paper cutouts of your pictures and some masking tape or painters tape whatever you're going to use and start laying it out on the wall and kind of creating your own design and how you might like it on the wall thing about using like masking tape or anything obviously it doesn't affect your paint so as you can see here I decided that I didn't actually like the initial layout so I moved it around and it's just really easy to use with your layout all you need to do is grab your nails your or your picture hook and your picture hooks with a hammer and just where you made a mark on the round paper from the back of the pictures just make sure you hammer in to that area so you know it's going in the right place and then just pull the brown paper away once you've done that you can start hanging your pictures and this was the funnest part because you're starting to see it all come together and my end design I just absolutely love it Um, the first part of this video I had so much fun doing it and it was so much fun collaborating with Decino on this they have got a, like an amazing amount of different posters and picture designs and I feel so lucky that I've been able to work with them uh, obviously because Jed and I moved in so it was a perfect chance to kind of decorate this part of my kind of office -y kind of beauty room it's finally coming together so I'm hoping there's a couple more things I want to do to it and once I've done that I'll probably do a bit of a tour of this room as well because it's coming together so nicely and I absolutely am obsessed with these pictures on the wall. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you've liked it. I have actually got a little giveaway as well which is going to be over on my Instagram account. So um, it is actually the A4 version of the picture that's just here. It is this really gorgeous picture with these um, nice big pink juicy lips that are on it. I absolutely love it. I would say that originally when I saw that I was like that's my favourite one. Then I absolutely love the one with the big black lips as well. So I just love all of them and they're such a reasonable price. 
and they've got a UK website as well now so make sure you go and check it out so I will leave their website and all their social media because that's actually how I found them first was through their social media then when they contacted me I was absolutely over the moon so I was like oh my god I've been dying to get some of these pictures and I've got them kind of posted around our house as well so I've got one which you might have seen on my Instagram as well which is kind of in my desk and we've also got one in the bathroom as well so I'm a little bit obsessed with these pictures because I just think they're amazing and such good value so make sure you go and check out their website you might be able to find some really cool stuff there for Christmas make sure you go and check out my Instagram for um, the giveaway and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys